Hello friends, today we are going to know about CS Card EZCO Multi Vendor Payment Gateway. As you know, we have already developed EZCO Payment Gateway for CS Card, but now we have also developed CS Card EZCO for Multi Vendor. With this add on integration, you can easily split payments among different vendors in admin. And make sure the Turkish currency is installed in your CS Card. To use this add-on properly. Now let us move towards the configuration and add-on updation part of this. For that you need to go to admin panel. This is my admin panel. Go to add-ons and click on manage add-ons. Now click on this plus button to upload and install Ezico add-on. Now click on local and browse the zip file for Ezico multi vendor. Select the file and click on upload and install. Once this add-on is installed successfully in your system, you need to configure this. Let us search this add-on. This is my Ezico Multi-Vendor Marketplace Payment Gateway add-on. To configure, click on this Settings gear button and click on Settings. Now you need to enter the API credentials over here. First option over here is API key and the other one is secret key and the last option is to choose the payment mode that is if you want to run it is in test mode or in live mode you can choose as per your requirement and click on this save button to save the settings. Once the changes have been saved you need to add a new payment gateway for this Ezico. For that you need to go to this administration and click on this payment methods. Click on this plus button to add a new payment method. Enter the name over here. Let us enter it as Ezico Marketplace. You can configure inline and outside form for this Ezico Marketplace. Let us say we are first considering the inline form and let us put the name as Ezico Marketplace inline. Now you need to select the template for this inline form. Template for inline is cc.tpl and the processor need to be Ezico Marketplace Payment Gateway. Once it is done, you need to fill all the mandatory details to set the payment gateway in your system. And to configure this, you need to click on this configure button. First, you need to set the order status for successful transaction. You can set the order status from this drop down for order status for failure transactions. And if you want to save the Ezico response at your backend, then you can select yes. Otherwise, you can choose no. Now click on this create button to add this payment method. Here you can see that Ezico marketplace inline has been added. In a similar way, you can add Ezico for outside. Let us add this Ezico marketplace for outside forms. For that, your template need to be cc underscore outside dot tpl and processor need to be same as Ezico payment gateway marketplace. And to configure this, you again need to set the order status for successful transaction and failed transaction. And if you want to save Ezico response for this outside payment method, you can select yes, otherwise no. Now click on this create button. Here you can see that two Ezico inline and outside payment methods have been successfully created. Now to work this payment method properly in your store, you need to make sure that all your vendors using this Ezico have submitted their bank details in the configuration settings provided. For that, let us go to the vendor panel. Click on this vendor name to edit the details. Here you can see that the vendor have been submitted and put all the mandatory details. Now, to fill the bank details, you need to click on this add-ons tab. And here you can see that Ezico sub merchant option has been provided. Vendor need to choose the type of sub merchant that is, is it a limited company, private company or individual. Next option is to enter the name of the vendor. These details should be legal. 
here you need to enter first name last name here ibn number tax office tax number and legal company title if it is private company then again you need to enter these details and if it is for individual then you need to fill all the mandatory details once your vendor has filled all these mandatory details then he will be able to avail the functionalities of ezico let us now move towards the front end to see the payment option whether it is available for customer or not this is my front end and i have added two products from two different vendors in my cart let us now proceed towards the checkout here you can view that under billing option there is an option available for ezico marketplace inline here the customer need to enter the card details and by just simply company news and accepting the terms and condition of the vendors he need to submit the order simply and for ezico outside marketplace there is an option for ezico marketplace outside once you select this payment option you need to submit the order by accepting the terms and condition and you will be redirected to the ezico website here you can see that you have been redirected to the ezico payment gateway here you need to enter the card details and click on this pay button for payment and for bkm express you need to click on this and you can directly pay via this bkm this is how you you or your customer can pay at your store via ezico once the payment is done your vendor will be able to view this payment under their accounting part once the admin have completed their payment success to their bank account that is when the admin completes the transaction the vendor will get the amount in his bank for which he has submitted the details on back end panel let us now check out the orders placed via ezico method this is my order view page at back end and here payment information you can see that the method chosen for this payment is ezico marketplace outside and here is the response which have been re received via ezico payment gateway and for accounting part you can go to this vendors and accounting here all the list of the payments will be created like this and here is the balance withdrawal if the vendor if the admin completes the transaction this transaction or this amount will directly get transferred to the a bank account of vendor which he has submitted this is all about my cs card ezico multi vendor payment gateway integration thank you so much for watching